As it happens, the key keeper and I have been busy again, and what we've been busy with today is making improvements to our air conditioner thermostat project. The first of many improvements that we made to it was to put it on its own dedicated circuit breaker down there. There's two missing circuit breakers up here because while I was in here, I discovered why at long last this double wide breaker didn't fit right. Turns out it's completely the wrong breaker for this box. So I got to get a replacement for that. But the other improvement that we made, and this is really something, instead of having all that stuff spread out along the floor, we've run a dedicated circuit in here to the Operation Panopticon monitoring room, which sounds so cool and secret that it ought to be a government agency. And we put all the workings for the air conditioner power control inside this NEMA box. This was something I found on eBay and paid a grand total of 20 bucks for, and not that much more to ship it. Basically all the same components are in use here. The switch kills power to the transformer so I can make sure the system is off when I want it to be. There's a fuse holder nestled in back there behind the switch to fuse the transformer in the event that something were to go wrong. It has a 3 amp slow blow fuse in it, mainly because that's what I could find. There's the contactor. The other wiring that's not switched, some of it right there, like the grounds and the neutral. So all that stuff works just the same way that it always did. There's an outlet to plug the air conditioner into. There's the air conditioner itself. And of course, just like there always was, there's the thermostat. It's kind of cool in here today. But when I turn the thermostat on, the air conditioner powers up just like it always did. Only now the whole thing is built in and the only thing that the key keeper and I have left to do is to screw the thermostat to the wall.